So what is long range shooting? You know, there's a lot of interest in long range shooting, but what is the definition actually? I don't think there, there is a clear definition of exactly where long range starts. Um, the way I think of it is anytime you're making major adjustments to your zero in order to hit a target due to uh, gravity drop and wind deflection, then you're getting into long range. You know, if you zero your rifle at 100 yards and you shoot to 150 yards, you don't really have to make a sight correction to hit your target. So that's not long range. But if you're zeroed at 100 and you need to shoot to 600 yards, well, now you have many feet of elevation to account for. And to me, that's where it becomes long range. Extended long range starts whenever the bullet slows to its transonic range. So the bullet comes out of the barrel at you know, several times the speed of sound and it slows down. Now, as the bullet slows down to approach Mach 1, the speed of sound, um, speed of sound is around 1116 feet a second, but when the bullet gets down to about 1340 feet per second, it starts to encounter transonic effects. And those transonic effects are more complex and difficult to account for than uh, the bullet flying through supersonic range, which is relatively well behaved. So these things are addressed in more detail in my books. But just for this general overview, I would say that the extent of normal long range is through the supersonic range of the bullet where you're accounting for bullet drop and wind drift. Extended long range shooting starts whenever you get into transonic and start accounting for all of those factors uh, to center your group on the target. Now, different rifles have different transonic ranges, different ranges that are considered long range. You know, you could 22 rimfire, you could zero your 22 for 50 yards and need a significant sight correction by the time you get to 100 yards. So 150 yards could be a long range shot for something like a 22 rimfire. Uh, you know, you look at different center fire rifles, a 308 Winchester uh, versus a 338 Lapua Mag. You know, you might, you know, the transonic range of the Lapua Mag might be close to twice of what it is with the 308. So, you know, there is, you can't just say that long range is a thousand yards and pass that as extended long range because depending on the equipment you're using, um, you know, a thousand yards might be a chip shot for certain large caliber rifles, whereas, you know, you're really already pushing it with a 308. So that's kind of my overview of what, how I would define long range and extended long range shooting. Long range is anytime you're making significant sight corrections to hit your target and extended long range is when you have to do that after the bullet is slowing through its transonic range of flight.